let's create a Jamboard assignment that you can use in your Google Classroom. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go up to our waffle and we're going to move down and look for the Jamboard app. So it looks like a little orange and yellow J and click on that to open it. Once you've opened up Jamboard, you're going to see in the bottom right hand corner there is a plus sign to create a new jam. So we're going to create a new jam by clicking the plus sign. And once our jam opens up, we're going to give this a title and we're going to call it um, Cursive A. And then what I'm going to do next is I'm going to go down here to the image and I'm going to search Google for a cursive A worksheet. I'm going to go down through here and find something that I like that I can use. And I like this one here, so I'm going to select that. And then that's going to pull that into my Jamboard. Now that I have this in my Jamboard, I can resize it. So I'm going to go ahead and resize this. And center it. And that's all I'm going to do in my Jamboard to save my Cursive A practice Jamboard. I created my worksheet in Jamboard. I'm going to go ahead and create an assignment for my students in my classroom. So I'm going to click on Create an Assignment and I'm going to give it a title. And then I am going to go ahead and add from my Google Drive the Jamboard that I created for this assignment and add it and then here I'm going to make a copy for each student and then I would put my instructions in here like normal give it some points select a topic and assign and now when this is assigned all my students have a copy of the Cursive A worksheet that they can work on in their Google Classroom and return that assignment back to you with their work done on their Jamboard. And it shows up right here under the topic and the students are ready to go.